Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing some shopping. Addison's party's coming up Saturday and I have lots to do. So it's gonna be like a full day of activity and prepping for the party. So I thought I would take you guys along on the ride with me. So lots to do here in the house first before I leave. I'm gonna head out to Sam's Club to pick up some things and then also Walmart. Um, I need paint, I need to do a lot of things. I need to go to Party City. Uh, so that's what we're doing today. So if you're new to my channel, I hope you'll stick around, consider subscribing and also give me a thumbs up on this video if you enjoy it. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right on in because again, I'm ripping and running today. If you want to see my day of activities, then make sure to stay tuned. So the first thing I'm gonna do is make breakfast. You guys know I am doing keto, and so I need to go ahead and make my breakfast so that I have a successful day. I will not be eating right now. I am intermittent fasting, so I won't eat until one o'clock, uh, but at least I'll have it with me on the go, and I can warm it up at my girlfriend's house when I get there. So that's what I'm gonna do first, is make my food, because I'm feeling really good about my keto journey so far, and I wanna keep it going. So I've got some eggs here. So I'm gonna make just some fried eggs. I got some eggs, I've got my spinach, right there and then I've got some chicken and then I did grab my snack also which is just a bag of almonds right here so I've got my bag of almonds ready to go already pre-measured by the way and then I'm gonna have my bulletproof coffee which is MTC oil and then this power creamer some stevia drops so I've got to go ahead and boil my pot of coffee right now and then I'll be ready to go and then when I get back home I can have my dinner and I'll be I'll be good so that's first and foremost, gonna go ahead and make that meal so that way I can have it later and put my coffee on the stove. So I'm gonna take my coffee on the go. I always order these on Amazon, these um, disposable cups with lids and then straws, and so that way I can take it on the go. I'm going to have hot coffee, but then I'm gonna add uh, then I'm gonna add some ice to it, so that way it'll make it iced coffee. I love iced coffee, and I'll be able to take this on the go with me. So that's the plan.
All right, so I've got my coffee here and I've got my snack for later, just in case I get hungry, and then my meal that I'm gonna eat at one. I am fasting until then. So I'm ready to go, y'all. So I can go ahead and prepare everything I need to take with me to my girlfriend's house. So let's continue moving forward in this day, because again, so much to do, so little time, but I know I'll get it all done. I have no doubt about that, so. All right, y'all, so I'm done making all the food again. So now I'm gonna sit down and write out my list of things I need to do today, y'all. It is almost, let me see what time it is. I'm pretty sure it's later than I want it to be. It's 10.48, so technically I should have started my day like two or three hours ago. But I was exhausted yesterday for some reason, so plus I didn't want to cheat because I'm fasting. And um, so I went to sleep and I'm okay with that. <laughs> so I am going to write down my list of to-dos and y'all the first thing is to get these eyebrows done because these eyebrows look a hot mess, I know it. So I gotta get the eyebrows done first because I've been trying to grow them back in. I took too much off last time trying to grow them back in. And um, so now I think they're ready to get done. So let me show you guys what I'm doing. Here's my purse. In my purse, I keep my Erin Condren planner. You guys know that already. My wallet, an Erin Condren um, zipper pouch or planning pack I keep in there as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and write out my to-do list for today. I already have my grocery list of items I need to pick up from the store. I use the daily agenda for that because I love these little slots here and how you can kind of break things down. So that's what I've got going on over there. So I'm gonna go ahead and write out a to-do list. So I'm just kind of looking over the list, make sure I have everything. I need to spray paint those hula hoops. And I probably should have done that before I go to Tamiko's house. But I'll bring the spray paint and the hula hoops to her house and I'll spray paint them there. Let's see if that works out. Oh, I need to grab the pillows from upstairs in Addison's room. See, that's why it's so helpful to have a to-do list, y'all. So I definitely need to do that. So this is all the places that I need to go today. As you can see, there is a lot going on, but I know I can get it all done if I balance myself and I kind of pace myself and um, go to these places in the order in which they're located. So I think I'm gonna number them. So I'll number them one for eyebrows two for Walmart. Whole Foods might not be done today. It just depends on how my day goes. So Whole Foods, uh, liquor store, Sam's Club is number three, Party City is number four, Lowe's. I'm either going to go to Lowe's or Walmart, so that would be number two. And then um, if I have time, Whole Foods, liquor store will be five. And then Tamiko's house would be six. So that's my route, y'all. Okay. So I made these last night, so I'm gonna take these with me. These are cupcake toppers for her party, so I'm gonna stick these in my bag. Stick my planner back in my bag. I'm also going to stick in my bag my lunch or breakfast. And I'll take my coffee with me. I've got two picks also just in case for the cupcake toppers. Not sure if I'm just gonna stick them right in the cupcake or if I'm going to use that to top them. So I definitely wanna just toss them in my bag just in case. All right. And I'll just grab my coffee on my way out the door. Put my watch and my ring on. So I'm also gonna check on my to-do list real quick. I just thought about it. And Addison's section where I have all her party prep and planning stuff. And I'm gonna see what I need to take from home. I already have my to-buy list because I transferred all of that into my Erin Condren, but this is everything I need to take from home. Some of the stuff I don't need to take until tomorrow, but if there's anything I can get over there now so that way the majority of everything is set up before tomorrow, then I wanna do that. Um, so I wanna go ahead and take the, um, the tablecloth covers, the pillows, the hula hoops. I already did the curtains. Um, not my glue gun or sticks. I'll take that tomorrow. The chairs I'll take tomorrow because I need them. The service group meets here. I already did my uh, Canon selfie. My camera is here, but I'll take that tomorrow as well. So I really just need the, oh, I need photos for Addison. I'll take those tomorrow. I really needed the table covers, the backdrop. I already take, took the backdrop covers there, but I need the backdrop stand. And the hula hoops, which I have right here. I'm gonna spray paint those and that's gonna be part of the dessert table backdrop. So I really just need three things. So 
It's so helpful to have lists, y'all. That's why I'm such a, a list maker. And so I'm gonna go ahead and grab all of those things. And then this is everything I need to do. So I need to spray paint the tables um, that my husband built for her party. I, my mother-in-law ordered the cupcakes. Um, I need to make the water labels. Uh, I need to, we need to blow up the balloons. That's what I'm gonna do at Tamiko's house. Spray paint the hula hoops. And I think that's pretty much it. And there's gonna be things that come up along the way and I'll just do those as they come up. So let me grab those items and then we'll be ready to head out the door. Again, I've got my coffee there, got these hula hoops here, and I'm just gonna make sure I get everything, and whatever I don't bring or forget, then I'll just take with me tomorrow. All right, y'all, stuff is loaded. I hope I'm not forgetting anything. Grab my coffee. Of course, that's important. It's gonna help me to have that energy I need to have. Put it there, and I need to grab my glasses, y'all, because my eyebrows look a hot mess. And so I'm gonna grab my glasses and put them on until I can get to the salon. And I need to secure the back right here because it's open for some reason. And I don't really know how to, how to keep it closed. I think I gotta lock it some kind of way, y'all. So I'm gonna figure that out. But I'm ready to go. Got everything I need and I got my list and I'm ready to rock and roll, y'all. All right guys, so I made it to my first destination, which is Walmart. Um, I just need to pick up a couple of things from here and I'm hoping to find the paint here and then I'm going to head to um, home, back home, because I think I want to spray paint the hula hoops before I get to my girlfriend's house, that way they're ready. And then my husband wants the white paint for the tables, which are part of the whole design. You guys are gonna get to see that because I think I'm gonna do either a separate video or I'm gonna include some of that footage in here so you can see how everything is working out and how everything turned out. So I'm gonna head in Walmart, hopefully it doesn't take me too long. And then I'm gonna get my eyebrows done in Walmart. I think they have a threading place in there. I've never got my eyebrows threaded, y'all. But I heard it's like life changing. So I'm gonna head in there, uh, see if I can get that done as well. And then if I can't find the paint there, I'm gonna have to go to Lowe's, which I'm hoping I don't have to do. And then after Lowe's, I'm gonna head home and uh, drop the stuff off, paint the stuff, and then I'm gonna really head out to go to Sam's and do all my other stuff. So. First destination is Walmart, y'all, and it always gives me anxiety to go in Walmart, y'all, because it's just packed all the time. So let's head on in. All right, y'all, so I'm done getting my eyebrows done, and so now I'm gonna get the things I need to get from here again on my list. All right, so I'm gonna get, not all the groceries here, I'm gonna go to Kroger to do that, but I'm gonna get, like, the stuff that I can't get at Kroger, I'm gonna get here. All right, I'm gonna grab some Mrs. Dash. I think I'm gonna get a couple of varieties of these. Um, they're salt-free, that's the table blend, this is the original blend. But I think I'm gonna get the, ooh, extra spicy blend. I'm gonna be using that a lot, y'all. Oh, and the chicken blend. And then I need to get some of this. This is what that YouTuber was talking about, the Creole seasoning. She said she loved it, so we'll get that as well. And I think that's all for this aisle, y'all. y'all, right, I'm gonna get some margarita mix because we're making margaritas. So I need to figure out what I need because I'm not like into like mixed drinks. But I'm thinking any sort of margarita, margarita mix will do. Maybe this one, Skinny Rita mix. Ooh, Skinny Rita sounds good. But I think I'm just gonna do just a regular old margarita mix. Ooh, classic margarita mix. That's what we're gonna do, and I'm on a budget. I'm super cheap right now because I spent so much money already. So I think I'm good. I also need some limes. So we're gonna get that as well. And then I'll get the alcohol from another store because they don't sell tequila here. All right, y'all, I need parchment paper. Ooh. Wait, where's the parchment paper? How come I'm not seeing it, y'all? I know it'll definitely be in like the, the crafting aisle, like over in that section where you do like the cake stuff. It'll be over there, so I might have to go there to get it. I don't see it over here. 
All right, y'all, this is everything I got so far. Got the spray paint, got the paint. It was super cheap here, y'all. That's why I love Walmart. And so I need to get some fishing line because we need to hang the hula hoops up for the backdrop. So I'm thinking something like this should work out. It says it's high strength, 500 yards. I also want to show you guys. I think they look really good, y'all. This is the first time I ever got my eyebrows threaded. And, oop, can you see me? Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, am I not in focus? <laughs> I think they did a good job, y'all. She even like went over it with like some um, eyebrow stuff. So I think she did a really good job. So I'm almost done in the store and I realized I need to go to the dollar store. So I'm gonna go to the dollar store to get a couple of things and then I'm gonna head home first. Cause the dollar store is right over there. So no need to head home when I can go to the dollar store first and then head home from there and then do all I need to do there. And then I'll be ready to head to my friend's house and get this thing really going y'all. All right, we're in the party aisle, so I definitely need napkins. And I love how everything's a dollar, y'all. I was gonna go to the dollar store for this, but I think it's gonna be pretty much the same quantity. So, we're gonna do white, I think. So I'm gonna grab, I think these have 20 plates. So I'm gonna grab like five of them, since of course they're only a dollar, and that works for me. So let's get five of these. And I'm hoping that's enough. Well, I think we said we were doing white. I'm pretty sure we said we were doing white. And then I'm gonna grab some forks. These are a 24 pack. I think that should be plenty. Um, and then we need napkins. And I think we wanted to do pink napkins. I love the hot pink. So what if we do these? Three of these. And then we need cups also. So we'll do a couple of these as well, if y'all can see them. And these come in a 10 pack. Or is that too much? That might be too much pink, y'all. Maybe I'll do the lighter pink. Yeah, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna switch some things up, y'all. But I have lots of options here. I'm not really into the gold, although her party does have gold elements in it. We'll see, y'all, because that gold is not really like a true gold. And I want a true gold. So I'm going to pick a couple of things out, and then I think I'm done. Oh, I need the parchment paper, too, which should be somewhere over here. And then I'm done. All right, y'all, so I'm done at the grocery store or at Walmart, and I got everything that I need. As you can see, she put it in that bin tote bin back there. Got the paint on the floor, y'all. I'm doing good, and it's only 12.23, y'all. I'm doing really good. I'm gonna break my fast at one o'clock. I have my walnuts, or not walnuts, but I have my almonds here, which I'm probably gonna use to break my fast because I don't want to eat cold food. Ooh. <laughs> that was weird. I don't want to eat cold food, so I'm gonna wait till I get to my girlfriend's house to warm the food up for my second meal. So I'll have like a super duper late breakfast, which is fine. So now we're gonna head to the dollar store. I need to get a whole bunch of aluminum pans for the meat and for the food and stuff. Um, just to take it there. When we get there, it's gonna be like all elegant and stuff with like dishes and stuff. So I just need to transport it there. I want to cook the meat at my house the night before which is tonight <laughs> and then um, cut up all the vegetables at her house I'm all about super simple I know it's gonna probably seem like a lot went into this party which it did but I didn't do as much as I normally would I would normally like y'all yeah y'all are gonna eventually see one of those type of parties but this is gonna be really 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 nice um, it's just that I'm all about the details of an event I'll try to insert some pictures here of some events I've done in the past but I love event planning, you guys, so this is gonna be super fun. So I'm gonna head to the dollar store, and then I'm gonna go home, spray paint those loops, like I mentioned earlier, and do a couple of other things, and then we'll be able to head to my, well, I gotta head to Sam's first, get the food, because I'm gonna drop it off at my girlfriend's house, that way it's already there. She has room in her refrigerator, I don't, because I just went grocery shopping, as you guys saw in a recent video. So I'm gonna drop all that stuff off over there, and then um, start blowing up the balloons and everything, and just get it going, y'all. So that's my next destination. Yeah, heading into the dollar store. And I only need a few things here, so I'm not gonna be in here for that long, y'all, because, um, thank goodness. I was gonna also look for favor stuff, 
So we'll see, because I need some stuff to stuff inside of the bags. So I'm gonna get that and then the aluminum pans and that should be it. Okay, y'all, so I made it home. Look at my handsome husband. <laughs> you look handsome. Okay, so there's the paint and then, um, well here, you grab the, I'll grab the paint and you get that bin that has food and stuff in it that I got from Walmart. For today? No, for the party, but I need to sort through some stuff that's ours. So you brought your stuff outside so you can, um, I'm sure it feels good to be outside too though, right? Not really. <laughs> it's hot. So let's see the progress going on over here, y'all. Ooh la la. All right, so these are these are gonna be the last two, right? So you're almost done. You just need the tabletop. Well, you got one right here. Yeah, well, I've got to put the tabletop together. It's easy. Okay. So this is how the table's gonna look, y'all. I gotta paint it white. Yep. So the kids are gonna sit here to eat. It's gonna be so cute, y'all. So he's gonna finish the last two because I need a total of three. And then they'll be ready to spray paint. So I'm gonna head on inside, leave this paint outside for him. I just got a white paint and satin finish. I was gonna do flat because it was cheap and I just need it for one day. And then I think we're gonna keep the tables and put them in our garage, stack them up, um, kind of get them assembled together. So it'll be like a three-tiered shelf in our garage and we'll use that for storage so that way we don't waste a perfectly good table. So that's the plan. So I'm gonna go inside and eat, sort through that bin of stuff I got, pick out what's ours, and then keep it moving. All right, y'all, so I'm getting ready to break my fast. I have this app here that I found out from a YouTuber called Zero. I think Marriage and Motherhood mentioned it in one of her videos. So I'm gonna go ahead and tap the button saying that I'm done with my fast since I'm about to eat. Well, actually, I'm two minutes away from eating. I don't know, maybe I did it wrong. But anyways, that's what I would typically use and I'm gonna start trying to use. So you guys saw me make this earlier. I'm just gonna pop it in the microwave real quick and then munch on that real quick while the hula hoops are drying. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray paint the hula hoops first so that way they're drying while I'm eating. So here's the hula hoop that I ordered from Amazon. And it's in this box, y'all, which is interesting. Hopefully it's the right size. Oh, that's cool. So I gotta assemble it. Hopefully it's easy to assemble. All right, let's see if I can set y'all down right here. All right, y'all, that was super duper easy. <laughs> so I'm gonna come and lay one here. I've got this drop cloth. It's a little bit dirty, but it'll do. And then I've got my gold spray paint, metallic gold, by the way, because I think metallic gold looks better than that brownie gold, and I want it to really pop. So that's what I'm gonna use to spray paint. So I just gotta assemble these last two, and then I'm gonna get to spray painting and let it dry while I eat. All right, y'all, so the first side is done, so I'm gonna have to let it dry. I'm so glad the sun's out today because it's gonna help with the drying process. So I'm gonna let these dry, and then I'm gonna come back, flip them over, and get the other side. 
All right, y'all, so I ate. I spray painted the hula hoops, as you guys saw. I did everything I needed to do. So I'm heading out to go to Sam's Club, and then I'm going to head to my girlfriend's house. I don't have that much to get at Sam's Club because I got a lot of things at Walmart. I just have to get, like, all the food, food items. So between Sam's Club and probably Kroger, um, I'm going to get that stuff, and then I'm going to head over there. So I'm exhausted. <laughs> I'm so exhausted already, and I haven't even, like, started doing any party prep. But I guess this is all a part of the process, right? So, yep, so that's where I'm headed, y'all. All right, y'all, heading to Hobby Lobby. And fortunately, Hobby Lobby and Party City are right next to each other, so that's gonna help me a lot. So, it's raining, of course. So, I'm gonna head inside and get what I need to get so I can get on with my day, y'all. This is what I was looking for at Walmart. So they've got lots of cute stuff here for girls and boys. She's gonna have majority girls at her party. So let's see, maybe they might have some flamingo stuff, y'all. That would be awesome. I'm just gonna get a couple of packs of things or maybe I'll get, no, that's too expensive, $20. We're not doing that. Although it does have a lot of stuff in there. I just left Party City. Now I'm heading into Hobby Lobby. I need to get a large letter A and I also need to get some flowers. Y'all, I'm headed to Sam's Club. It is my first time at Sam's Club. Can y'all believe it's my first time? Not at Sam's Club, so let me take that back. It's my first time shopping at Sam's Club, like with my own card and everything. So I think I might have went one time in the past with someone else's card. <laughs> But now I have my own card, and I probably should have been have my own card. But hey, better late than never. So I'm going into Sam's Club to pick the cupcakes up, and then probably to get the majority of the food except the meat, because I want it to be fresh. Um, and it's going to be sitting in the hot car if I get it now. So I need to wait until I leave my girlfriend's house to get it. So that way I can cook it when I get home, and uh, bring it to the party tomorrow. So we're headed to Sam's Club, y'all. All right, y'all, I just had to get my card and everything, so I'm gonna pull my list out. And see what I need. Hoping to get some good deals. I don't know what to expect, though. So I'm gonna get some Capri Suns. My kids love these. And I'm gonna need some for the party anyways. So I might as well grab some now. I was thinking of even getting some water. They should have water here, y'all. I would think. Yeah, I see some on the other side.
Okay, so they've got the ground chuck here for $16, which is $284 a pound. Not sure if that's good, <laughs> but this is a lot. This is $23, that's $16. So I'm gonna see how much do I need, y'all? Because I'm doing chicken too. All right, y'all. <laughs> yeah, that was, it was perfect. I just went right back there. She grabbed it for me and I was good to go. Thank you. <laughs> All right, y'all, I just made it through my first ever Sam's Club trip, and I'm excited about it. I didn't get to explore like I really wanted to, but I got everything I needed, plus a couple of things for our family that I needed. So, I thought I would show you what I got. It's kind of like a haul video too, right? So I got two waters, 45 case, I think. I got the chicken, of course. I got some Capri Suns for the kids. I got the two things of cupcakes. Y'all, this is such a good deal. There's 30 for $13. That's such a good deal to me. And then I've got a whole box of goodies there. Lettuce. And then I've got some peppers, tomatoes, blueberries, some cheese down there, salsa, some asparagus for keto. And what's that right there? Oh, the cheese. And then some yellow rice for, because I'm doing... I told you guys I'm doing tacos and margaritas, or I don't know if I told you guys that. I think I said it on Instagram for Addison's party. And so I think I'm gonna make some rice too. And I think I'm gonna get some chips um, also. So it'll kind of be like Mexican. Then I got two things of drinks. And I think it was about $200 for everything because the tissue was like $20, but it's 45 rolls, which is awesome. So that's my haul, y'all. So I'm gonna get all this stuff packed up. I still have to go to the dollar store to get some flowers. And then I have to go to Kroger to get the remainder of the things because they didn't have like jalapenos and little things. Um, so I've gotta go there to get that stuff. Y'all, it is already, let me tell you what time it is. 3.56 and I'm still not done. So let me wrap this stuff up by getting everything in the car and then we'll head to the dollar store and then I might do Kroger like on the way home because I can technically keep all of that stuff in my house and just bring it tomorrow. So we'll see how I feel y'all. But everything I got, I'm pretty satisfied with it and I had a pretty good trip. And so that was my first ever trip like this to Sam's Club and I think I did good. Well, so I made it to my girlfriend's house. She's so awesome, she let me use her pool. And so this is all the stuff right here. And then this table right here. And then she's got a ton of stuff in her craft room. And then this is all the other stuff, y'all. So that's so cute, right? Totally goes with the theme. And then we've got lots of signs. All of this stuff is for her party, y'all. I may or may not have gone overboard. <laughs> That's to be determined. And then I don't know what's in there. That's probably some of her stuff. So yeah, y'all, we got a lot going on. We got a lot to do. Look at that cute flamingo, y'all. So darn cute. So, yep, we got a lot to do. So I'm excited to get it all done, though. And um, so I'm going to start by blowing up the balloons, I think. Yep, there's the other bin, the blue bin right there. So, yep, that's what I'm going to do because they're not here. They'll be here in an hour. So I'm going to start by doing that. All right, y'all, so I just finished blowing up all the flamingos. There are five of them there. So those are going to be great for just, you know, for the kids to kind of use to um, float around in. They're going to love those. And so what I'm doing right now is I am packing up the favors. So I got these little bags right here cute little bags that say thank you on them and then I'm gonna put a little flamingo bracelet in there aren't those so cute and then also I'm gonna put some glitter putties in there so cute and maybe a bubble if it'll fit and some candy so we'll see what all will all fit if only one bubble or one putty fits in there then I'll probably do the putty because Addison loves the putty and um, and a bracelet and some candy. So we'll see how it all goes. But that's what I've got for the favors. I thought they would be so cute. I love this little flamingo on here. It's gonna go perfectly with the whole thing. All right, y'all, so I'm done with the gift bags. They turned out really cute. I've got 20 of them, so I'm hoping that's enough. But I still have more candy and bracelets, if not. And this is Addison's special one that I made for her that has her own little stuff in there that I know she would like. I mean, same stuff, it's just more. And the colors I know that she would like. So we're moving on to balloons, y'all. So this is gonna be fun. <laughs> so I've got pink, white, a lighter pink. And then I've got gold with little confetti inside. 
I've got a true gold. This is a true gold because you know sometimes it's hit or miss with certain balloons with it being like a brown gold. So I got my little balloon maker machine right here. So I'm going to get that going. All right, y'all. Oh, look at all those balloons. I think that might be enough. I don't know, because I'm making, or we're making a balloon garland that's gonna go around the dessert table and it's gonna be like massive. So it needs to be a lot of balloons, but I think that's enough. I don't know, I, I might do a few more. All right, y'all, it's about 11 o'clock at night and we've got it almost all set up. Isn't that so gorgeous, y'all? So we've got a fill in up there at the top, fill in over there and just fill in where we need to. So that way everything looks symmetrical. Those pillars are going outside at another table and that's the photo booth. So we just got a few more things to do and then we'll be done for the night and ready for tomorrow. Hey guys, it's party day, woo! <laughs> I was out till three o'clock last night doing party stuff, y'all, at my girlfriend's house. Yes, it was, I'm about that life. <laughs> I'm about that party planning life, y'all. So, I, it's about 9.47, so I'm headed to Walmart, and I also have to go to Party City and pick up some last minute things. So that's why we wanted to set up last night so that I could see what would be considered last minute, minute like what I needed, uh, what was left, what we were missing. And so I'm gonna go pick that up right now. I cooked the food last night. Yes, at 3 a.m. when I got home, I made the ground beef. I made nine pounds or 10 pounds of ground beef, y'all. That's crazy. And then I also made, um, well, I tried to make the chicken, but y'all, my crock pot is broken. Like I couldn't find my crock pot. And then I remembered that it's broken. So I had to wait till this morning. I need a new crock pot y'all I had to wait until this morning and use my pressure cooker which is awesome anyways because it's super quick so it gives you that slow cook taste but it doesn't take as long as your slow cooker would taste so I just put it in there for 30 minutes and it was done so we are ready to go rocking and rolling so I'm headed to those two places and then back to my girlfriend's house just to do the last minute setup so I just wanted to show you guys how excited I am about the party. I talked to Addison this morning. I gave her her cute little outfit. She's wearing something flamingo themed and she says she's so excited and so I'm just excited for her. This is her first ever party. It's her graduation slash back to school party for us. School starts on Monday, but I don't know. By the time you watch this video, school will probably have already started. And so, um, so that's where I'm headed today. So I'm excited. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. And so I will show you guys how everything looks once I get there and it's all set up I'll show you like the after and like you know how we set everything up I'm excited to show you guys that so stay tuned for the rest of this day so that you can see how the party goes made it to my girlfriend's house so I'm back so she's got this table set up we don't have that that much to do but right now we're outside setting up these little tables they're so cute y'all are gonna love them watch 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 first of all we switch out all the pillows on her couch to be flamingo and we're setting up these tables right here. Yeah. Hey girl, how are you? Thanks for coming. Hey David, how you doing? Good. You like it? <laughs> it rained out. Yeah, AJ said it was raining in Lawrenceville. So, hey, how you doing? Yeah, you're busy. Just got the last minute stuff, you know.
Oh, now you're doing it. It's cute, Tito. You like it? Hey, hey girl. girl. What's up? I like your high bun. Oh, she got a little nap in the park. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. She I don't see what's in the party. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. You like it? Is it cool or what? It's cool. It's cool. You like it, Maddie? Mm -hmm. Yeah? Yeah, take a picture next to it though. Everybody look up this way. Hey. Maddie, look